Hi guys, after this video, you will know how to integrate OpenAI API, for example, ChatGPT completion with your Nest.js application. Fasten your seatbelts and let's go. I'm going to create fresh Nest.js application with NPM manager. Now I can go to this directory. Okay, I want this template to be open for any kind of modifications, so I'm gonna create separate module. Let's name it, for example, smart thing. Hmm. Okay, in case you had the same error, we can fix that with updating Nest.js schematics to this particular version. Once again, of course I have to run uh, npm install first. We need also the controller, the same name, and service. Some depreciation warning, but don't worry about it. Uh, we can also remove the spec files for simplicity. Also, we don't need app controller and app service. We need two more packages. Uh, OpenAI uh, itself and .n for API key management. Okay, finally we have proper setup and now we can uh, write some code. I've prepared some basic LLM instruction. Of course you can modify it to whatever you want. Now I am importing OpenAI from OpenAI. I have to pass it to service constructor uh, like this. Uh, to be consistent with instructions, I'll name my function get all prices from text. And to use ChatGPT completion, we have to call uh, .chat.completions.create. Inside, we have to pass object with model type. Uh, in my case, it's GPT 3.5 Turbo. Array with messages. First, with roll system and the second with roll user. And here I can pass text argument from the function. Here we can pass temperatures and a lot of other arguments. I don't remember what is the value of default temperature, so I set it to 0.7. In simple words, the bigger temperature, the more creative the model will be, but also it is increasing its capability to hallucinate, so uh, you have to keep that in mind. And I want to return chat completion Choices, index, zero, message, content. Okay, the service looks fine. It's probably ready to go. And uh, now let's jump to controller. I want to trigger my function with get request. Okay, of course I forgot about constructor. Let's name it the same. Get all prices from text. Service. And for the simplicity, I will type the message here instead of pass it uh, as a param or something like that. Today I bought coffee for $6 and cake for $7. Now we have to add some configurations. Actually, I forgot that we need one more package and it's nest.js config. Probably the better approach would be to convert this whole module to be dynamic, but for the simplicity of this video, I will keep it static. First, I'm importing config module itself. Then we have to add OpenAI provider. And use factory. I will explain that in a moment. Here we have to pass an API key. Okay, so use factory, as you can see, is a function that returns an instance of the provider to be injected. So it will return OpenAI provider already equipped with API key, but we have to inject a config service. And last thing, export smart thing uh, service. Now maybe let's create .n file. And this variable has to match this one. Last thing, I am gonna update app.module. Get rid of this old imports. 
uh, we don't need controllers and providers as well. One thing we need is config module. It's dynamic, so it should look like this for root. Okay, let's try to run application with npm run start dev. Something is already listening on my 3000 port, so let's change it to be 3001. My prompt has $6 and $7, so I am expecting LLM output to be $13. response exactly as I expected, everything is working fine. Uh, that's it for today, thanks for watching, subscribe for more videos and probably see you soon.